Hey, what's going on, everybody? This is Tyrone back with Tech Life. And here I have a great article for you guys from the Mobile Report. I will leave a link to it in the description so you guys can check it out. So the, the, the video that I made about the Verizon price increase a, a few days ago is now starting to make its way onto articles. So as I told you guys, it's, it's going to hit business first. And then, and then I'm told it's, it's set to hit, to hit the consumer. Verizon is once again increasing legacy plan prices. So this is the third time, I guess, in the last three years that, or within the three, last three years that this had happened. Not once, not twice, but now three times in the past year, actually, or in the last year, it looks like, Verizon is increasing rates for uh, customers. On the heel of their latest quarterly earnings release, showing some major shareholder gains, Verizon clearly isn't satisfied enough. They absolutely must make up the difference after only making $4.9 billion in net income in the latest release. After all, what better way to, to complement a $2.2 billion increase in free cash flow over year than even more money? So again, they're the raising the prices on, on the business plans. For now, it's it's listed uh, here below, as you can see. You guys can can check that out when it when it's effective. The plans that are going to be increased, all of that is listed in this article. So what's what's interesting here is Verizon is going to continue pulling the price lever. We might even see that again within this year sometime, and then maybe again next year. But when is enough is uh, enough? You know, and I, and I and I said and I and I titled that in the, in a previous video. How much longer can Verizon continue to raise price before it just before the floodgates just open? Like I stated in the video yesterday, Verizon. There are several different options now: MVNOs, cable players, other MVNOs that are that are getting into the the wireless game. That you can be on the Verizon network for less. It's 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 here now, and I think Verizon is starting to realize that because now they're pushing the value segment, twenty five dollar entry price point. So, it it's not what it used to be. It's not where you used to have to get Verizon post uh, postpay because they really didn't operate any prepaid to get the Verizon experience. So you had to you had to use them, and you had to get their postpay plans on top of that, which are which were priced higher anyway. To get the Verizon experience now, and I know priorities matter on the prepaid side or whatnot, but there's Visible Plus for that's still cheaper. There's some other options out there where you can get very, very similar Verizon network experience for less, and and that's the that's the big point that I want to make. As Verizon continues to raise pricing, even business customers they can select T-Mobile now, get a cheaper cost. There are other options out there versus what we saw in the past and for the consumer it's the same there are track phones the the total wireless by verizons of the world there are a ton of options out there to choose verizon and be on this on the on this you know network leading best network in the united states for less there are options out there for everyone and that's what I think Verizon doesn't 100% realize today. But I think they're starting to catch on. I think they're starting to they're starting to come around. Hey, we need to get this value segment. We need to get some of these customers back cuz even some of our higher end customers are leaving us for lower cost. And that's something that I think the numbers will start showing on their end. So like I said, the the articles are starting to come out from the uh, from the Verizon price increase. Uh, stay tuned for more. I'm sure everyone else now will, will come out with that too. So if you're new to the channel, make sure you guys like, share, subscribe, follow my social media outlets. This is Tyrone with Tech Life, and I will see y'all in the next one. Peace.